This is WENY HD News. Good morning, Twin Tears. Good morning, everyone. Happy Thursday. John, looking good for the weather, right? Yeah, it sure is. Yesterday, 85 degrees. <laughs> Summer preview yesterday. That's what that was. Hope you enjoyed it. And if you enjoyed yesterday, you'll like today. Great. You get more of the same on the way. Let's see your weather headlines after your Crystal City Sky Cam. Where we're off to a nice start in Corning. Just a few clouds around out there, kind of limiting the sunshine. But once we start getting that sunshine uh, higher in the sky, those clouds will basically melt away. We'll be looking at mainly a sun-filled sky. Temperatures today similar to yesterday, although just a couple of degrees cooler. Let's see what's happening with your weather headlines now. I'm talking about another warm one out there today. It's really feeling like summer. Now, the good deal about uh, today and yesterday was we just don't have the humidity out there yet. So even though we have temperatures into the low and mid 80s, it just doesn't feel like it because the air is still nice and dry. But we enjoy those 80 degree temperatures again for today. Turns cooler for tomorrow, but cooler a relative word. We're still looking for temperatures in the low 70s and then a nice weekend on the way too. So that's the good news. We didn't just have a nice midweek, have a nice weekend for you as well. 53 right now in Elmira, looking at some clouds around for now. But again, those will be thinning out throughout the rest of your morning and day. 53 in Corning, 55 up in Dansville this morning, 53 in Tawanda and 49 out in Ithaca. We spin the map around, take a look at some other local temperatures for you. And it's lots of upper 40s and low 50s from Mansfield, Thurston, Hornell, all checking in in the upper 40s and low 50s. Satellite and radar, we have this front that's settled well off towards our south. Came through yesterday. Did you feel it? Probably not. We didn't see anything with it. Just a few clouds, no real rain showers. Uh, those rain showers and even some thunderstorms mainly focused along the southern tier of Pennsylvania down towards, say, Altoona, Harrisburg, and heading over towards uh, the Schwanksville and Philadelphia area. For the rest of your day, here's what you can expect on your 24-hour planner. Lots of sunshine. That's what you can plan on. Temperatures closing in on 80. Good night to uh, have a nice dining out experience or maybe a nice lunch outside today. You're waking up tomorrow morning, though. Temperatures closing in on 40 in our coolest valleys, but it'll be warmer on the hills where temperatures only bottoming out in the upper 40s to around 50 degrees tonight. On the big picture, there's that front with the showers and some th storms focused along it, but warm for us. What you don't see here is some cooler air that's been building up here in Canada. That'll be settling south as we look ahead towards tomorrow on the weekend. But again, cooler. We go from 80 down to the 70s, so maybe a touch uncomfortable right back into that comfort zone between about 70 and 75 degrees. Future track shows those showers getting going, especially across West Virginia today, but we're high and dry up here in the tiers with your sunshine and, well, warm temperatures too. Cool tonight, but we warm it back up for your day on Friday. This is paused for you here at 8 o'clock. Notice uh, and a couple of extra clouds around tomorrow, a possibility with some of those cooler temperatures. You get some of the cooler air in the upper levels of the atmosphere. Heating of the day creates more clouds. In case you wanted to know. Saturday, more clouds around too, but temperatures still holding in the low and mid-70s. Let's take a look now at your seven-day forecast. Beautiful stretch of weather, including your weekend, which has some great events, including Spring Fest down at the Hills Creek uh, Park down in Wellsboro. Be great for that on Saturday. Next chances for rain not arriving until sometime early next week.